quick little speed round, having to do with the movie, of course. Sure. Leather or spandex? <laughs> mm, spandex. Leather's hard to move in. <sighs> spandex. <laughs> the leather's terrible. Well, tell and tell us about your experience with the, with the leather in this film. It was disgusting. <laughs> it, it, it took like 30 minutes to get on and 30 minutes to get off, and I, I, I was sweating every five minutes, and the mask was like. <laughs> pushing into my forehead and I would take it off and there would just be like a red indentation around my eyes. It was, I think I think I had like a non-stop headache for this whole movie. <laughs> I guess I'm I guess I gotta be the spandex considering Chris is leather, so um weapons neither or, really. Weapons or bare hands? In what sense? In fighting. When it comes to fighting. Go bare hands, man. You're a man. You don't need <laughs> weapons. You do that with your fists. Well hopefully you don't you can just do it with your words and you know solve all your issues. <laughs> That's how I choose, because I can't fight. Bare hands. Bare hands. Favorite superhero from childhood? Wolverine. Wolverine was my nice. favorite. Iron Man was my brother's. My dad was a really good artist, and he drew a huge Iron Man on my brother's wall, like a mural. Wow. And I was the second child. I was like, Dad, paint me a Wolverine. He's like, I'll get to it, I'll get to it. Never got to it. <laughs> I still hold that to him every day. <laughs> it's upsetting. From my childhood. Um, probably a Spider-Man. You know, that's the most memorable one that really took an impression on me. Um, I think there are other great superhero <laughs> characters than Spider-Man by far, but um, that was one that I remember as a kid. I would probably say any Disney princess is my superhero. <laughs> Those are my superheroes. And when they sell them all together and they yeah. have them all at Disney. <laughs> and it's like Mulan, Sleeping Beauty, like... And Oh my god, I can't. I'll freak out. I'll go on a whole tangent about princesses. You don't want me on that tangent. <laughs>